Hello guys, welcome all my revivers, all my old and new revivers. Today your girl has a haul and it is from Target, Dollar Tree, and a couple things from Walmart. So I hope you guys are ready because I'm excited about some of the stuff I bought from Target. But let's get into it instead of rambling. Make sure you thumbs up. Make sure you share the video and make sure you hit those notifications, okay? Because your girl throws up random videos throughout the week, but every Saturday there will be a new video. So let's get into it. All right, so at Target, I went to Target to find um, something for the middle of my table. Something for the middle of my table and some baskets for the top of my refrigerator. Don't y'all hate when you have like all this stuff on top of your refrigerator and you can see it, I can't stand it. it. It irritates me and I try to stuff it anywhere I can. So I went to Target and I found these. I don't even know if this is showing you guys how big these are. They have one smaller. These are so big, my hubby was like, babe, them is just too big. Those are not gonna fit on top of the refrigerator, but they do. And we went in Target and we were fiddling around trying to find bags of chips. The big bags of chips, the family size, all the sizes to see if when we put them in there that they're hidden. I would rather have these two like this on top of my fridge. Being that we have a smaller home, we don't have a pantry, and we don't have a lot of space to put extra or excess of things. So this can go on top of the refrigerator and we can maybe put um, paper towel, extra ginger ale, because we always have to have ginger ale in our house. Our extra ones, we always sit on the side of the refrigerator. The extra bags of chips, we always put on the top of the refrigerator. We're always throwing something on top of the refrigerator. And I think this right here will be clean and neat. And it comes with two nice handles. And these are some sturdy baskets. And these were $7.99. And the ones that were a little bit smaller were like $5.99 but these are going to be so perfect on top of my refrigerator. And if I remember, I'll try to insert a picture of me um, organizing the clutter on the refrigerator and then I'll probably do a mini another video and then showing how it looks when I put the stuff inside the basket. So I'm happy about those. This basket's on top of the fridge and I love, love, love it. So the chips and stuff are in there and you can see it. Love it, give us extra space and looks cleaner than having a whole bunch of clutter on top of the refrigerator so that's what they look like and i'm redoing y'all know i did my um my little one's room but i'm also doing my other daughter's room and she has like the gold and black and white and all the little pretty colors that y'all will see soon um so i seen these lamps in target and this lamp y'all was 7.46 okay 7.46 and I like it because if she wanted to, she could put bracelets like, you know, bangles or earrings or she don't really wear that stuff. You really don't. She's sitting right here. But maybe her earrings that she do wear, she could probably throw them inside here because it has an indentation. So it could be used for two purposes. And it has this cute, cute little thing. It's wrapped up inside the, but it, it's a little pull. So you don't have to go in there trying to twist nothing. She could just be in her bed and just pull it down. 746, you cannot beat that. You cannot beat that. So I'm really excited about that. And then I got also from Target these cups. These cups match the bowls that we have. And these were 55 cents a piece on clearance. And being that we all have our own cups and tumblers, I have one of these. My husband has a dark gray. My baby girl here has a stainless steel. Um, actual thing that has a twisty top and really has a light teal color one. So those are our cups that we walk around the house with and have because I got rid of all the cups, all those tumblers, cups, water bottles. We need to save space, get things more organized and minimize things, so I got rid of them. So these will just be cups for people who come over and say, hey, I need something to drink or if they have kids, I don't want them to drink out of the glass because I break them, I toss them in the sink, I'll give them this. So these are, um, some nice little, I mean, very sturdy, way better than the Walmart um, cups and the, um, these are called tumblers. They're microwave safe and dishwasher safe. So if you have a Target around you, go check them out because they have gray. They didn't have any more gray at my Target. They had the smaller gray ones, but those are the regular price at like 79 cents. Still a deal. So we got that. And guys, oh my gosh, go get those other spatulas. I had to have this. This is a silicone slotted turner spatula that's what it is this thing i don't know if you're a cook you will understand what i'm talking about i get happy about stuff like this because i hate when things 
make my cooking process more difficult. I purchased a silicone, I mean this, I don't know if this is stainless steel under here, but this thing is hard, like really hard, and it is so, so tapered off. I mean, to the point where if you're making anything and you need to get under there, this is gonna do exactly what it needs to do. The two that I have now, and this is a Target brand, it's apparently this was $5. I don't know if y'all can see that. This was $5. Now, these are the ones that I have now, and they suck. This one is not so bad, but I probably won't get rid of this for stuff that I just need um, a flat um, spatula for. But you can see the difference. It's not tapered off at all. And then this one, oh gosh, I don't know what kind of tapered off they call this. Do you see the difference in these spatulas? Let me show y'all the difference. Do y'all see the difference in the top and the bottom one? I don't understand what they call their self doing, but every time you go to push to get under something, all you do is push it. You just push it all around the pot. So this will be going right back to Walmart, and this is so worth it. I was looking for the spoons and stuff, couldn't find it, but that was it. Then I got this set. Oh my gosh. This is going to be the centerpiece on my dining room table. I love organic, earthy, neutral, rustic vibes. Y'all know I'm very eclectic. So this here was $24. And if y'all can see that, it is so pretty. It looks like it's stone. It's heavy as heck. So that one was $24. This one here was $15. Isn't that cute? And this is like a gray. This one is more so like a taupey tan with cream or whatever. This one is like a gray. And these are so heavy. And then this one was 20. These are ceramic. They're ceramic. Hand form, watertight, by Target. Made in the Philippines. And this one. Do y'all see that? It's like abstract. Uh, it's another word. I can't get the word out. Oh, it's not asymmetrical. It's, I can't get the word out. But anyways, I'm like that Aztec print type thing. Love it, love it, love it. So that is that. So here they are, guys. I love, love, love them. I think they were so perfect for this space, and they match very well. So let's see what else I got. Do y'all remember the... Hold on. Let me pause it. Pause it, babe, and show them if those what I'm going to replace these two. Well, I'm going to show y'all these first. I have some lamps, and my baby's going to show y'all the lamps really quick, so that way y'all can see what I was looking for before and I couldn't find, and I, I use, if you've been rocking with me, remember when I was unpacking from the big move, and I found my shades, but they were crushed, and I said, I'm going to utilize them until I find exactly what I want. I found them at Target. So I'm going to show you, for those of you who don't know, what I'm going to re be replacing these ones that I just got from Target with. I'm going to be taking those off and putting these ones on. So I'm going to show those to you real quick. Go ahead and lampshades that I was making work because I could not find the rectangle look that I was looking for, the rectangle square look, so I made those work by spray painting them and I did a DIY on how to change the color of your shade, but now I'm about to replace them with these bad boys. Alright, so I went in Target and I seen these and all the I was like, oh my gosh, this is what I wanted, all white, and I wanted to put like a big, thick, pretty ribbon of something. I have to find this fabric or ribbon of gray just to make it. I just want lines and cuts and stuff everywhere. So instead of spray painting these, I'm gonna put like a big piece of fabric going all the way around, like some type of funky design or something. So yeah, these right here. This one right here um, that I'm getting ready to pull up was on a shelf like this and I didn't like the fact that it was open and had a little teeny mark on it. The guy took 25% off of this one. So this ended up being $14.99 and this one was $19.99. So if you're looking for some uh, nice shades, check out Target. So I love these shades. And like I said, $19.99 for this one and $14.99 for that one. And then, here, put those over the back. Those don't look so much better and so gorgeous in my living room. Yes, I'm loving it. All right, y'all. My hubby, he always go in the clothes section. If you do not know, Target has these bomb clothes for men, women, and kids. They, they like, don't sleep on Target. Their sandals and shoes and stuff. My hubby went and found this motorcycle jacket. It's faux leather, not real leather. And it's an XXL. 
and it has like the pot patches on the pocket on each side and it fit him so nice and this was this was $49.99 you cannot beat that so got that for him and I was like oh Oh, babe, you look good in that. We got to keep that. So we're going to keep that. So got that. Went to Dollar Tree. My baby needed some stuff for school. So I got her these um, correction pins. And if you have not used these correction pins from Dollar Tree, they work really well. Like, I had to literally open it to see before I purchased this. I was like, I'm sorry. If I like it, I'll just keep it. But this um, correction pen is the bomb. It actually is really opaque. And it's like a pen. Like, literally like a pen. You see? It's the bomb. So, I got those for her. She needed some sticky notes. So, I got those for her. And she needed, these are not from Dollar Tree, but she needed some coins binders. These things go really fast at Walmart. These are like four bucks, and we got her three of those, three binders. These high schoolers, they be needing to put a lot of work inside their binders. So that's what we got, the three of those binders for her. And back to the Dollar Tree, I needed a stapler. I had this cute black and lime green one but it would not stay closed. So the lady was like, it was defective. So she had me swap out. So I went and got the bigger one because the other one was like half the size of this, like really small, really cute. But I was like, well, maybe I should go with the bigger one. So I got that from the Dollar Tree. Oh, from Target, I'm sorry. I got these, these were on clearance. I don't know how many, 16. 16 of these clips and these are for outdoor lights which I needed because if you guys remember I did a haul on Clarence Christmas dec decorations and I got these pretty LED light sickles that can go across our whole house because our house is not really huge you know what I mean so I'm going to use these to clip outside to hold the lights up on the actual house so I'm excited and these were only $4.98 and when I went to look at them at Target they're like eight something so that was a steal giving me the Target I've been hearing a lot about these um, hooks at uh, Dollar Tree. I haven't really used them, but I will. And I'll let you guys know how they work out for me. Um, I'm going to use them for our dishcloths and our gloves. And one for my um, apron to hang it up on the wall instead of hanging it in my little thing I have over there. So, um, And then like my brooms and stuff like that. You don't see how they work. And if you guys are interested... Just remember to ask me how did they work for me so I can let you guys know. So this one is the bigger one and you get four for a dollar and they hold three pounds. So it's kind of like the command strips. So we're going to see. These ones are the medium and you get six of them and they hold two pounds. And then these little babies here. Oh my God, they're so tiny. You get 12 of them and they hold one pound. I mean, for the price of these bad boys work. They're going to be putting command strips out of business because people are going to be coming to Target. I mean, <laughs> coming to Dollar Tree to get their actual hooks. All right, guys. I think that is it. We went to all these as well. Rizzy wanted some Lucky Charms. We got bacon, sausage. And I also got, oh, wait. I got some of um, the carpet stuff. Now, for some reason, that room that my daughter had, um, it was the room that we kind of sat in and watched TV and let company and stuff come in. And being that it has carpet, I put carpet down, guys, just to get us comfortable in the house. But my goal is to do what I did in my living room. If you didn't see how I refinished these old floors and bleached out the stains and brung them back to life. I want to do that with each room. But that was too much to do this duo room and then every bedroom. That was just too much. So what I want to do is one at a time do each room. But I just, for some reason, the bake, the Arm & Hammer, don't, the Arm & Hammer by itself doesn't seem like it's doing what it needs to do. So I got two boxes of this stuff. Some Arm & Hammer. I got a spray bottle, too. A spray bottle, and I got some little goodie scrunches um, for the kids. And that was it um, for her to put on her floor and just let it sit, like, for a couple hours and then vacuum it up. So that was my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the haul. Make sure you, like I said, thumbs up. And I will see you guys in my next video. Later, Gators.
this is where I am on social media. Be sure to check me out, but also go check out my other channel, The CPR Vibe. The link is in the description box where we talk about all things reviving our lives. There are many playlists and how-tos on this channel that can help you save your coins. You can also see my renovation journey. If you are new to this channel, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so you're alerted of all the new videos. Later, Gators.